Hey, it's Patrick, and let's talk about Design Engineering Incorporated heat shields and exhaust wrap. You can see we have a really kind of specific color up here, and this is called the titanium. Now, they do have the standard black and white, like fiberglass based, but this stuff is very, very interesting. I've used it on a number of builds. So what we're looking at here is what they call titanium, and it only comes in this bronze color. And they say how they make this is they actually crush up lava rock, and it gets infused into the fibers. It can withstand heat up to a sustained 1800 degrees and flashes up to 2500 degrees. And if your motorcycle is running that hot, you have a way bigger problem. So basically this is gonna work great no matter what. And something you get with any type of heat wrap is the ability to get those hot fumes out of the exhaust sooner. It helps move it along. It insulates it, but it actually helps performance. The other thing I mainly use it for is in lieu of a heat shield. So if I'm running like a racy stainless steel pipe or a set of like chopper pipes, there's no heat shield, you can just wrap it in one spot to keep that one spot from your leg hitting it. Or like on my hooligan bike, I wrap about three quarters of it. Now this stuff is a little bit different than your standard wraps, the fiberglass. One, you don't have to throw it in the bucket of water. Like the fiberglass stuff, you put in the water because it starts to like tear up your hands and whatnot and it's easier to do with water. You don't do that with this. Um, you go ahead and wrap it the same, you overlap, but when you cut this stuff, it's really like kind of soft and silky fibers. You have to be careful because it'll kind of strand on you, but it works extremely well. Now it's available in one inch and two inch widths. This is the two inch and links anywhere from 15 feet to hundred feet. And pricing is gonna vary depending on width and length. Like a two inch 25 foot piece is gonna be around 35 bucks. Whereas like a two inch by hundred foot roll is gonna be closer to $100. If you're doing a set of pipes, how much you're gonna use really is gonna vary on how long that pipe is. I would say to be safe, 25 feet of pipe get you there unless you're doing like tip to tip on some drag pipes. Um, I use this stuff, like I said, all the time. These metal zip ties are key. You can use safety wire at the end to tuck it and tighten it up. These metal zip ties actually just look much, much cleaner. Now over here, we have a heat shield made out of the same material that titanium material that has those lava infused fibers. This is about a three and a half by six. They have a four by eight. And this is more of like a patch that's made of it with a metal trim to it. And it comes with your standard kind of hose clamps. You can form this around the pipe, bend it up, make sure it lays a little bit, you know, with the pipe. These I would use if you want a little bit cleaner look. So I want that clean look. I don't really want to do the pipe wrap, put the, the wraps on either side. It's going to be not really that much more inexpensive. These come in close to the same price for just this piece, but it is a much more finished piece and the install is much easier. This can be a little bit tricky if you've never done it to get everything to lay down just right. This is pretty straightforward. Either way, if you're looking to do something custom with your exhaust and you know step the performance up a little bit or just give yourself a little bit extra heat protection, these are gonna be both very hot rod options. If you're looking for more information on these, go ahead and hit that info tab on your desktop or mobile device. That's gonna take you to the product detail page where you can read other writer reviews and more specs about both of these products. If you're still looking for more information, go ahead and reach out to your customer service team. They would love to talk to you about what works best for you, your motorcycle, and your budget. I am Patrick. Thank you for watching. Now go work on those motorcycles.